here's our equation y equals 4 cosine 2x minus 100 degrees out of parentheses minus 3. So for a, it'll be 4. For b, it'll be that 2. For c, it'll be negative 100. For d, it'll be that negative 3. And then down here for amperage, it's just carried that 4 down. Now, if that 4 was negative, it would be written as flipped as well, but it's not. For period, it'll be 180. That is because 360 divided by 2, that coming from here, equals 180. Are you locked out? Let's get you there. So for phase shift, it'll be 50. And that has gotten from your negative 100 divided by 2. That 2 coming from, once again, B. So it comes down to 50, be negative 50. Right? So it would be just normal 50. Because it's negative, negative, so that becomes positive. And then vertical translation will be down 3, because it's negative 3 on D. And then for the graph, I've already plotted out a graph here, and I've already marked out all the points. So basically all you have to do is plug this into your calculator, make sure that it is in uh, degrees under mode for it to appear proper, not radians. So take your graph and just connect the dots. Try to make them, whenever you connect the dots, curved, because these graphs are actually not nice and pretty. You know, they aren't these, they're curved. So not that, you want that. And then, whenever you're done with the graph, make sure you put arrows on the ends. And close them. And that is how you do that equation.